Please put your chin in the chin holder and rest your forehead against the metal rod. I think it's a great opportunity for undergraduates to do research while they're here. This is one of the benefits of a research institution. You get a chance to participate, be part of the big conversation, of big questions being addressed. I joined Jesse Graham's social psychology lab this semester. It is working in values, ideologies, and morals. I found that it wasn't enough just to learn about how people differ and how people maybe act in certain ways, but really understanding in my own way and asking my own questions was really interesting to me. Because honestly, in the beginning, I sort of thought that psychology was just in the clinical practice, you know, where you go in, see your therapist, but I sort of, when I came here and started doing research, I realized how heavily of a research component there is in psychology and all the rigorous science that really goes into figuring out all of this stuff that then gets applied. You learn the knowledge and the theories in your classes. You've learned about these models, you've learned about these uh, influences and variables, but there's nothing that can equal taking that knowledge, going out in the field, doing research, understanding how it works, what you need to do to get it right, and assembling that into something that you can give back. Beginning of this year, I started the undergraduate honors program in the psych department. My independent project is looking at gang identity, the perception of law enforcement, and gang crime. They get to work on it for a year and a half to two years. You become an expert on it. And so many times I see some of the students who work with us that that sort of fashions their career. Working with a professor is an incredible experience and one that I didn't think would be possible at a school of this size. It's been really wonderful to work one-on-one -on -one with Kate Johnson. I was able to set up a time every Monday we meet and it's called Julia Learning Time. It's just a wonderful time to be able to sit one-on-one -on -one with her and not only learn direct field experience, but also we've had long conversations about what I'm interested in and how to get to that point. I took a class with Dr. Darby Saxby when she asked for research assistance, I immediately signed up and I applied for a SOAR grant. To be able to get funding to do this, these kinds of projects is really important. Coming into the lab was the first time that I was really challenged to problem solve. It's opened so many doors and so many opportunities and beyond that it's opened my mind up, I think, to the sciences and to the future and what there is out there. And I think that will carry on into anything that I pursue. I hope to continue my education through grad school. I will be applying to clinical psychology programs. I think I want to go into forensic psychology, possibly social work, and really getting involved in research, at least for me, has been one of the best things at, at USC so far that's prepared me for my future. Working in a lab is a great experience, and I hope if you're planning to come to USC, you'll take advantage of that opportunity.